All right, so this is the uh, last and final update to my daughter's science experiment, the effect of music and vibration on the growth of plants. We posted like eight other videos from start to finish showing how we uh, planted the seeds, how we stimulated the seeds. In case you're just joining us, we planted uh, six seeds each in controlled environments. One set of six seeds got uh, planted on top of a, uh, basically a subwoofer vibrating at 50 hertz 24 hours a day. The other set of six seeds um, was subject to classical music playing 24 hours a day and the last set of six seeds was subject to no external influences whatsoever. Um, so starting over here, these last two tomato plant rings you can see here, uh, those are the two that were subject to vibration and they did uh, exemplary in the growing process under the controlled vibration uh, uh, just under the control of vibration 24 hours a day. Once we planted them outside, they kind of stopped growing. These two next to it, it's kind of hard to separate where they start and where they end. But these two next to it right here were the groups that were subject to classical music. They seem to do pretty good and they have bared fruit. The vibration plants have never bared any fruit whatsoever. No tomatoes off the vine. These last two over here were the group that were subject to no external influences, and they've by far bared the most fruit. We've probably got 10 or 12 tomatoes off of these two as compared to only four or five tomatoes off of the classical music bunch and zero tomatoes all the way over here off of the vibration group. Uh, the tomatoes that did come off were quite nice. They were very tasty. And um, I think the big reason we didn't get our yield that we should have is we planted these tomato plants outside a little bit too late. So, And plus, they're not in an area that enjoys, you know, 8 to 10 hours of light a day. They're on the uh, west-facing side of our house. They only get light in the afternoon. So I think that has got quite a bit to do with it. Anyhow, I just picked a tomato, a couple of tomatoes. So um, let me pause this, and we'll take a look at those. All right, so here are the uh, last couple of tomatoes we picked off the vine. They, uh, they're okay. They're, they're fairly red. I know they're going to be nice and juicy inside. But I just think that because we planted these things a little bit too late in the season, we didn't get our full yield. But um, anyhow, I just kind of wanted to give you this last video update. Hopefully it'll uh, stimulate some young minds out there to uh, try the same experiment. I'd love to see the results. If you uh, do try the same experiment, please um, uh, please send me a, uh, a message so I can take a look at it. Once again, for all you have been following and watching the science experiment, the effect of music and vibration on the growth of plants, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.